What's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Bass Union. My name is Joe and today I'm fishing in a new body of water that I've never been to. So behind me we have Lake Englebright. First time ever fishing this place. First time even coming this direction. So coming from Orville, it's about an hour drive. Um, you know, doing some research online, not a lot of places in California have water. And this is one of the bodies of water that is still full. So I'm gonna get this boat in the water, get some rods rigged up, put them on the deck, and see if this place got any fish. I'm not sure if it has spotted bass, smallmouth bass, largemouth bass. I'm not sure what's in it, what type of bait fish. Um, I really have no idea what to expect, but all I know is they have water and I'm gonna go fishing. And it feels good to be on the water, especially a place you've never been to. You know, that, that that's one of the funnest things to me is to go to a new lake and try to figure it out. We got about 10, 10 or so different rods on the deck, all sorts of different techniques, you know, going from top water to working baits in the middle of the water column to the bottom. So that's, that's part of the fun is figuring out, you know, where the fish are at, what they're doing, and you know, looking at the time of year, it's we're already in October. These fish should be in some type of fall feed. I've got a water temperature of about 60 degrees, so I imagine you know it's it's just going down. So I'm gonna I'm gonna idle around for a little bit, see if I can find a bait, see if I can find any activity, and once I do, um, put that trolling motor down and grind it out. So I marked a few fish, fished a few coves out in front of the dam. I don't know, I, I really haven't had any bites yet. So I got the big motor going, I'm just idling around, seeing if I can find anything else that really just stands out to me. So far, it's pretty desolate down there. I'm beginning to think coming here was a mistake. I've had five bites, five nibbles. Not one I've been able to connect on. I don't know. I've got bit on a drop shot. I've got bit on a jig. I've got bit on a Ned rig. I don't know. Um, one thing that really stood out to me was some of the houseboats uh, coming out of the marina. So, it's about two o'clock right now. I spent about a solid four, four plus hours fishing, 
just hitting spots, running, going to the back of pockets. Can't find no bait. And these fish are so scattered. I don't know. This place is weird. Uh, you guys fish this lake. Give me some pointers. Comment down below. Because I'm sure struggling. But like I said, I'm going to run over, hit some of the houseboats. Maybe we, can catch, maybe we can catch some fish that are suspended underneath, hanging out under the shade. So we'll see. Well, I think this is officially one of those days. I got a big skunk in the boat, but I'll tell you right now, it happens to the best of us. I had some opportunities, had a few bites, just didn't eat it. They short struck it. I'm beginning to think maybe they're trout or something. Um, fished some of these houseboats, didn't see any fish. It's just, I don't know, it's weird. I'm sure if I had a little bit more time, I'd be able to figure it out, but I just, I don't think there's bass here. <laughs> Um, real quick, just wanted to uh, share with you guys, I brought out a EWG Deadly Nedley. So what that means is we got an extra wide gap hook in a Ned head. So I've been wanting to come out with this for a while, so let me show you guys. So I'm pretty excited about this. We got this in a variety of different sizes. The lowest is a 16th ounce all the way up to a quarter ounce. So we have one odd hook and a two odd hook featuring a VNC. Um, these things are gonna be really awesome, especially when you need a weedless presentation, but you want that Ned Rig, that Ned Rig head. Uh, this thing's gonna be really awesome. It's gonna catch a lot of fish. So I know this isn't much of a video, but it's something. I promise you guys on the next trip, I will get this skunk out of the boat. I will catch him. It happens to the best of us. So go ahead and like this video, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and we'll see you guys in the next one.